Hi everybody, welcome to John Swift Live. Thanks for watching this video. Thought he was whistling at me. I wanted to ask you a question. See this sign up here? United States Garage. It's part of this building. And I guess it's an office building type building over here. <laughs> you know, I always, I always should get the name of the the name of the street that I'm on but if you ever watch these videos you know that I'm not good at that I'm just gonna guess and say it's like pineapple and there's a big construction site right here and Ringling is right close to here Ringling is over here that's Ringling Avenue well, I can see the sign almost hold on just pause for just a second while I get the name of this street see it says cross street is that the is that the circle I'm getting totally out Pineapple, we're on pineapple. See that? And Cross Street. Oh, Cross Street is this street, okay? See that street? And then there's this street. Okay, now that we got that taken care of, back to the uh, United States garage. Okay, this building is the United States garage. Is, does that have any meaning to the building? Because I don't know. Is there such thing as United States garage? Cause there's a couple shops in here, but I drive by this and I see that sign that says uh, United States Garage. Can anybody help me with this? I don't know why that mystery boggles me. But you've got Awesome Orchards store here. Right here, Awesome Orchards. And there's a couple shops in this. And I guess this is like the main thing of Sarasota Magazine. So I guess, do they just pick this out of a hat, United States Garage, as a title for this building? Somebody thought it would be, so you can see part of the sign, United States Garage here. I always wonder if it was something historic to this building. It doesn't look like an old building, to tell you the truth, so don't ask me why I'm, and don't ask me any questions. Oh, this guy's taking a nice U-turn. Easy, easy, easy. Excuse me for being in your way, thanks. He's parking. Don't, make it, don't get me started on people's driving around here. Anywho, any what's it? So that's it. That's all. That's all I wanted to ask you was about the United States Garage building. I'm pretty, I'm pretty thoroughly convinced now that there is nothing to this garage thing. That it's just nothing more than a name. But if you want to add your comments to satisfy my curiosity. And you know I'm going to get distracted by something else. You know, I did a video a couple months back about murals. And there's some really nice murals over here too. And don't ask me what street this is either. I'll have to figure it out. Orange is right down there. Look at these murals. They almost look like paintings. It almost looks like they took a, a picture and put it on there. It's kind of shiny. You know, I think it's starting to rain. It's kind of shiny, so it actually looks like a picture. Let's take a closer look at this picture painting it is a laminate you can see it's kind of shiny here it's like a lamination of plastic pretty neat though they're doing a lot more around the city that I've noticed there's a lot more and there's one over I actually see a mural way over there that's coffee and glasses there that's what they officially called that is coffee and glasses and uh I'm making a concerted effort to not put me in the whole video. Hopefully this is working out good. Just, if I have a point to make, I'll, I don't want you to see what I'm seeing. So I'm trying to shoot these videos somewhat more with a perspective for you to be seeing stuff, not just looking at me. But there's another interesting, see I did, this is what John Swift Live, so I'm making a point now. So this is what John Swift Live is all about, is seeing things in real time Usually no editing unless there's something that I don't need to put on there. Is showing you what I'm seeing live or live on a recorded medium. But it's a guy with a spray can. And what does it say? Let's take a let's take a longer look here. K-A-N-O-S. Canos. Can anybody see that? It's kind of all weaved together. Something. 
and this uh, the little title down here says made in France I don't know if that's the guy's name but there's quite a few artists out here and there this might be the artist oh see I see it says MTO which I've seen this guy a couple times see the MTO right down there I've seen that guy and here's a little bit of a it's hard to tell sometimes if this is actual graffiti or simulated graffiti I don't know if there's there's an actual difference between simulated graffiti and actual graffiti it's pretty neat though I, I enjoy that it's you know it's better than looking at a white wall isn't it I don't know what shop this is but you can see some people working in there I don't know if they're saying why is that guy got his camera pointed at I'm gonna wrap this up see how far we in we're in about see my bad eyesight I can't see we're in about wow my eyesight's really bad 631 okay now I saw it we're gonna wrap this up thanks for watching guys once again this has been a John Swift production all rights are owned by John Swift of course and of course here's Cross Street if you're not familiar with Cross Street in Sarasota here it is take a good look that's Cross Street. We'll see you guys later. Have a great day. Thanks for watching.